What is the meaning of life? This question comes up as I'm sitting here meditating at this beautiful alpine lake in Switzerland. And I wanted to share something with you that I know is going to support you so deeply in your journey, in discovering the answer to this for yourself. Because there's many ways to answer this question, what is the meaning of life? And I'm going to share with you some revelations that I've received in my incredible journeys with ayahuasca, which is a powerful, life-changing plant medicine from Peru that allows us to see, truly see, not through these eyes, but through the inner vision, and see into the nature of reality, existence, who we really are, why we're here. And in this video, I'm going to share with you something that's going to not only help you discover what is the meaning of life, but also help you understand what your personal purpose is in this incarnation. And it's so important that we are starting to ask this question and really put a lot of energy into discovering our highest truth because the energies are accelerating and no longer can we get away with what we used to. We used to be able to ignore our hearts, ignore the voice of our higher self and live our lives based on what other people might want of us or what society expects of us. But we're starting to understand that there's nothing more important than discovering our own highest truth, the highest potential that we have come here to express in this world that ultimately uplifts the collective humanity. And so, what is the meaning of life? I'm also going to attach an article to this because I can only share so much in this video. And I want to scratch the surface about this, but I urge you to read the articles and click the link in the description as well as, or possibly on this page, to really go deeper into this question with me. So, the first thing that I recognize as the deep importance of why we are here is to grow. It's to evolve. We have come here as souls in a human body, almost like planet Earth is our school. And we have so many lessons that we're here to learn through our experiences, especially through family relations and the difficult times, as they are the things that teach us the most. We have come here to evolve. And so many of us are on a journey where First, we have to go through a lot of pain before we understand the importance of asking this question of what is the meaning of life and asking ourselves, what do we really want? An aspect of discovering the true meaning of life is also completely about discovering what we want in this reality. We have come here as powerful creators and we can do, be, or have anything that we want. And it's up to us to be clear on that. And the experiences that we have often give us clarity on what we do not want so that we can get clear on what we do want. And this is the journey of growth, of evolution. We have come here to forget our connection to the source, to forget our connection to the divine, and that is a very important step because it's only through the forgetting that we can understand the importance of coming back to. And this is a huge reason why evolution and this human existence is like our school. Because there are only certain lessons that we can have in this human incarnation that we cannot as souls. And it is the ups and downs, the peaks and the valleys, like you can see behind me, that make for the beauty of this journey. It's only with the valleys that we can truly appreciate the peaks. And it is really important to understand that the difficult times in our lives are there because they are the teachers that we have. And so to answer this aspect of growth, and evolution. It's about really pointing to the challenges that we have. And if you're watching this video, 
There's probably something that's happened in your life that has triggered you to ask this question. Maybe a difficult experience, as it is for so many of us. Because we can no longer put up with the pain of the difficulty and challenges if we don't ask this question. I'm, of course, I can go into this so much more, but I want to scratch into the surface of different perspectives that we can have for what is the meaning of life. The next is to be happy. To be happy. That is so simple, yet so many of us complicate it. We often chase things, and this is one of the greatest obstacles to our happiness, is that we are inundated and programmed from our world to think that our happiness comes from the external gratification of material possession. But it's not true. It comes from being in nature, spending time with yourself, discovering your passions. And it comes from love, connection. It comes from really asking what am I here to do on this planet? And this is different than what is the meaning of life, because what is the meaning of life is something that we can look at as a blanket answer for all of us. Yet what is the purpose of my life is unique to all of us, unique to each and every one of us. And I promise you by watching this video and reading the content that I'm sharing with you below, you're going to get more clarity on what is the personal highest expression of your purpose. And on top of this, what is another obstacle that stops us from being happy? And that is, as I mentioned, the chasing. We are convinced and programmed to do and to make our lives as we identify ourselves with our jobs, with money, with what we own. But when we can start to understand that we're something so much greater than what we possess. We can start to discover the true secret and answers to what actually makes us happy. And there is an interesting way to go about doing this. So many of us have to literally incarnate time and time and time again before we can understand these lessons. But I found a medicine called ayahuasca from Peru, which is an indigenous plant that they have worked with for thousands of years that completely accelerates our evolution. And for those of us who are called to this, click the link in the description below as there's so much more information that I can share. But above all, what is the meaning of life is to love. It's to share that love, that joy, that growth. As we expand as individuals and as we grow in our personal journey, as we start to understand what's most important to us, we are here to share that with the world. We are here to uplift others, to shine our light, to discover our gifts, to find out what truly makes us happy. And the only way we can do that is by asking, what truly makes me happy? It's really simple, and yet we overcomplicate it. And how can we love? And I'm not talking about romantic love or even family love. I'm talking about sacred, divine love that knows no gender boundaries or race boundaries or age boundaries and is simply an expression of the heart and a connection from one being to another, regardless of any commonalities or differences. How do we do that? We have so many blocks around our hearts that we have put there on purpose as a mean of pr protection because we've been hurt. And so we close our hearts, so many of us do, in order to protect ourselves from not getting hurt again. But it takes a very conscious effort to dissolve those blocks and let them go and understand they no longer serve. So my challenge to you is to really look and ask yourself, is there anything that's stopping me from loving 
in the greatest, highest way that I possibly can, or from being the happiest that I can be, and to ask the inner teacher. For the inner teacher is the ultimate guide and everything that I'm sharing is simply a reflection of the inner guidance that I've received that you also have within. And so read the link and the content in the description or below this page and find out more about ayahuasca because there's nothing that I know that has helped me to release the blocks around my heart to be happier than I've ever been, and to really discover how to share my gifts with the world and uplift others, then what I share with you in those pages and in those words. Thank you so much. I look so forward to seeing you in my next video, and I pray that this supports you in discovering your highest truth. This is my prayer to the world. May all beings be happy and free.